Hello booktuber, my name is Elizabeth. Welcome or welcome back to my channel, Book As In Books. In this video for Poetry Thursday, I'm going to read a poem by Henry Wadsworth Longfellow. But before I do that, I want to show you the book where it comes from. It comes from this collection, it's called No Place Like Home, and it is from the Everyman's Library Pocket Poets pocket poets collection and when I went to the bookstore the bookstore had received a whole bunch of them apparently because there was a lot of choice uh, there were collections about poems about insects poems about flowers poems about London poems about uh, forests and there was a whole lot of choice and I was attracted to this one and the reason I think I was attracted to um, poems about the home is I think that uh, for one part, I understand down to earth poems much more than um, poems are about, I don't know, the soul or uh, existential questions and things like that. I think I appreciate poems about concrete things. And the second thing is that uh, in the past two years, um, because of the pandemic of COVID-19, home has taken a whole lot more of importance. Uh, for me, it is the second year anniversary of me teleworking. It was on Friday, March 13, 2020, that at the end of the day, I gathered a bunch of files, I took the laptop from work, and I went home thinking, okay, next Monday I'll work from home, and it's going to be like that for three weeks, maybe four. So I had taken files for the equivalent of three or four weeks of work. And it's two years later, and I am still teleworking and there is still no um, no instruction about when we will go back at work regularly, ordinarily. Um, we are still awaiting that. So I don't know if there will be a back to normal thing. So for me, it's been two years since I've been working from home. I did go back to the office once in a while because we can go back on an as needed basis and we have to warn ahead of time and it's complicated. But it, I've been back a few times in the office uh, for short stints, but I was on my own. I had no colleagues to chit chat with and it was really, really weird. So uh, yes, all of this to say that this collection about the home spoke to me. And one of these poems uh, by Henry Wadsworth Longfellow, so that was written like over a hundred years ago because he died in 1882 so the poem is at least 140 years old and probably more than that and i thought it was just so on topic with the pandemic <laughs> uh, the poem doesn't really have a title it's known by its first line and that line is stay stay at home my heart and rest so um I'm pretty sure that the pandemic is not what uh, Longfellow had in mind, but I have to admit, this is what I have in mind when I read it. So here it is. Stay, stay at home, my heart, and rest. Homekeeping hearts are happiest. For those that wonder they know not where are full of troubles and full of care. To stay at home is best. Weary and homesick and distressed, they wander east, they wander west and are baffled and beaten and blown about by the winds of the wilderness of doubt. To stay at home is best. Then stay at home, my heart, and rest. The bird is safest in its nest. O'er all that flutter their wings and fly, a hawk is hovering in the sky. To stay at home is best. And that is my pandemic-related poem. Thank you everyone for listening. I will see you in the next video. À la prochaine!